Having faith in one another is like having a mirror that if it breaks, it would be impossible to fix it back to its original form before jumping into the story. Make sure you click on the bell icon and subscribe to our channel. Let's say that the name of my wife was Savannah and I was several. Savannah was 27 years old and I was 28 years old. It was from the beginning that we were college sweethearts. As the years passed, we became more and more attached to each other. However, unfortunately, we were not able to study after college because of financial issues, which meant that we had to give up studying and work for the sake of the family in every fair we were involved in. We supported each other unconditionally. We were very fortunate to have a partner who stayed with us even in the darkest of days. As a matter of fact, people tend to leave when a bad time comes along. We worked very hard to ensure that we were stable regardless of what happened. In the past, I had worked multiple jobs at a time such as selling flowers and being a ticket seller at the cinema. At the same time, Savannah also worked as an instructor of yoga and part-time nanny. We had intentions to get married at some point when we became a bit older. But before we could do that, we had to get a fine apartment to we live in to achieve this goal. We spent countless hours working day and night to get one after two years of doing. So, we were able to get one and got married. In the end, the most important thing that I was able to do was because of her, even though I had no power to do so, but I was able to do it because of my motivation. And that was Savannah. At the age of 25 we became parents and as a result, we became more attached to each other as far as we are concerned. It was one of the best moments of our lives. It was something I couldn't explain to anyone. Nevertheless, I believe that our responsibilities have increased and that our love has also increased. At the same point in the meantime, it was just before the birth of our baby that we were expecting. This. At the end of the seventh month of her pregnancy, she had stopped working after the birth of the child and onwards, she did not take up the job that she was offered due to the fact that she was not feeling well at the time it was reported by the doctor that she had some complications during the delivery procedure. So I advised her not to work until her health was back to normal. As a matter of fact, I was also able to find a well-paying job as a laborer in a construction company in a way, it was quite easy for me to tolerate the expenses of my wife and children. However, after a few weeks, I found a few things that she had bought from the market that had not been there before. First of all, I thought that her sister had given her money. So I did not ask her about it. However, after a few days things changed, a new baby pram caught my eye the other day, it was quite an expensive item. As a result, I asked her where she got the money from. As she explained, she had saved money for the future and was using it for the baby as well as one of my co-workers who was also my friends showed me a cam girl that looked almost like Savannah due to the fact that she wore a mask, we were not able to see her entire face. It was first my eyes that were blown and I thought that it was a but then I realized that it was not her. That was a live show that I watched for a bit before telling him to shut it down due to the fact that I wasn't feeling good about it at the time. Then I got back to my house after having a few drinks with him. Then I saw her wearing makeup. I thought it was strange, but I did not pay attention to it because I was exhausted because she just had given birth to a baby. I avoided the possibility of having fun with her in those days. I started spending a lot of time on the internet, so I became accustomed to staying it. It wasn't until one night when I was feeling a bit naughty that I opened up a site of came girls on my computer while scrolling through the page. I was able to find a video in which a girl who looked like Sava was doing something dirty. It was a recorded video, not a live video before that time, 
I had only seen a few seconds of her videos on my friend's phone until that time, and then I started watching them on my computer anyhow. I noticed that the background washroom was similar to ours or maybe the washrooms are similar. I don't know. However, I watched the video recording of a total for 10 minutes. As soon as San Nava walked into the room, I abruptly shut the device off. In all of those videos, everything was shot in the washroom, but just with the lights turned off, just as I was about to fall asleep. I suddenly thought that the Kane girl was wearing the same ring that Siva wore. Despite my best efforts, I still couldn't get rid of the thought in my head. I tried to forget it, but I couldn't. It was not that I was not even able to sleep at all. There was a point when my brain was telling me that it was the, as the minutes passed, whatever the case was, I was still caught up in that thought till the next day. The same friend then began to watch the live came girl for a while. As he was watching the live video on his phone, I suddenly grabbed his phone and watched the video on it. This is the first time I had become familiar with her and I don't know how it happened. As soon as I handed him the phone, I asked him how long it would take for this live session to be completed. Approximately 20 minutes later, he said my first thought was that I should go home and take a look at it. Unfortunately, it takes me almost 50 minutes to reach my home from there. Due to this, it wasn't possible to do it. As I asked my friend how I was going to be able to get access to the live shows, he told me the price I made the payment. And after that, I was able to access her live shows. The reason I did this was that I could find out exactly when she began doing the game shows. At the exact time. The following day I decided to do something different. Instead of going to the work, I decided to go to a nearby garden. Instead it was then that I waited for her life came to start. Eventually she go online at 11. Suddenly I ran to my house as fast as I could. I was able to reach the place within 7 or 8 minutes. I knocked on the door hardly on my first try. She did not open the door, but she did open it on my second attempt. When I knocked again, her bathrobe was covering her entire body. As I asked her why she was in bathrobe, she said she was in the bathroom and was about to take a bath. When suddenly she came over to open the door, it was impossible for me to believe in her. I was asked by her why I came home early today. In my statement, I said that my boss had given me a day off. My first look was to check the K-show in my bedroom after I went to the bedroom as well as the girl. She was also offline at the time. But then my eye caught sight of the strap that was sticking out from under the bed. I checked it and it was the same kind of lingerie that the girl wore in the video when I checked after my dad changed into belief that she was doing king sessions with people. I was more convinced it was as if my brain had frozen and my legs were shaking because I discovered that what her reality was all about. My head began to ache badly and I got a severe headache in the washroom. She was doing her business walking out of my house. I felt like I was helpless and didn't know where to go. I didn't know what to do. Having sat in the same park where I was sitting earlier, I decided to go back to it. There was no end to the amount of time I spent there. It is true that I couldn't waste a single day from my daily job. But now it doesn't matter to me anymore. And I was sitting there just reflecting on why she chose to do this for herself. It took me many hours to come to the conclusion that I was going to make. It would be appropriate to me to do something which she could never ever imagine. In her dream. If she did this, she now had a clear understanding of where the money was coming from. In the past, she was able to afford her expenses a bit more easily since she had a bit of money to spend. It was also amazing to me that she had bought the money that she was using. She told me that she had saved money before giving birth to the baby. Whenever I asked her where she was, where she got the money, she used to say she had saved afterwards. I went on the internet and searched for everything I could find about her on websites. 
I was able to find many videos of her on the internet and I found that she also had camp fun with people in private and earned a great deal of money in doing so. As soon as I got a new phone number, I messaged her to let her know that I had all her videos that I was aware that she was Sarah and that I would tell her her husband about all this. At first, she did not reply to my messages. But after I sent her a video, she suddenly asked me what I wanted, she suddenly replied, the first thing I told her was that I wanted money. She was asked how much it was. It is about $5,000 that I'm looking for. I started receiving calls from her in the messages. I told her that she should not call me as I'll send this video as soon as I am able. In any case, I threaten her a lot. And she eventually agreed to pay me the amount I wanted. It took four days to give me the money when I contacted her again. After a few days, I asked her if she could make me happy in private show after initially denying it completely. I managed to blackmail her and she eventually agreed to have Kim fun with me without a mask on. It was the first time she revealed her face to me and came, my face was not shown to her. The whole video was recorded by me. It was now time for the next step which was to catch her red-handed in the morning of that day. I left for the job early in the morning, but I was waiting for her live cam session after it started. I returned home and jumped into the house slowly through the back window as I made my way to it. It was with great kid that that I opened the door of my bedroom. It was then that I discovered that the door of the washroom was locked. So I punched it with my might and broken where I found her half naked and doing some kinky dance moves. The first time she saw me, she was extremely shocked. Her trap was the one that started all sudden after I found her naked in washroom. In her words, it doesn't look like what I see when I look at it. My first response to her was, do you think I'm crazy since I have seen everything on the internet? Honestly, I did not care about her anymore. So I told her to leave as I worked day and night to take care of her and our child. She was doing all this behind my back as well. My order to her was to get out of my house as soon as possible. I told her that she wasn't allowed to bring the child along with her and that she couldn't take it with her. Then I filed a case against her for custody of our child. It was also fortunate that I was able to hire the best attorney by the money I received from her. I was defended by a lawyer and I won the case as a result of all this, I uploaded her video on social media in which she had not worn the mask at all. I believe that all these things should be enough for her to be burned in hell as well as in the world.